So what, once again, folks, what we have here is a paradise called breakfast fit for a king, straight from heaven. God, food on my lips, bananas, orange juice. I'm in paradise. Everyone else is going to be coming here. It's going to be insane. And all the right reasons, all the trash is going to be blown away. People are actually going to be happy. They're going to have amazing bodies straight from their birth. Um, it's going to be a revolution, thank God. Okay, All the trashy, non-foods are going to be blown away. It's going to be a giant sweep all across the earth. God food is going to reign supreme in the lips of men. By the way, cocoa equals lip. Um, equals up. Um, God food is going to reign supreme as uh, the nutritional choice all across the world. People are going to be set free like you wouldn't believe. The cocoa is going to be flowing like water all across the nations. It's going to be a landslide victory all across the world. The cocoa economy is going to go through the roof. Everyone's going to be panicking in all the right ways. Um, people are going to be happy and screaming their heads off like never before. Um, all sorts of dumb products and competitors are just going to be disappeared. Um, children are going to be happy. Seniors are going to be happy. People are going to be walking outdoors like never before. People will abandon automobiles and all sorts of, all sorts of dead crap like you wouldn't believe. There's going to be pedestrianism like crazy. People are going to be walking all day long like they should and want to. Um, hiking is going to go through the roof. Life and real love lives are going to go through the roof. Um, like I said, cocoa is going to be flowing like water. The demand for cocoa is going to skyrocket and it's going to keep skyrocketing. And everyone's just going to be consuming cocoa, cocoa, cocoa. It's going to be the word, the word, the word. Everyone's going to dump out their coffee, dump out their alcohol, dump out their beer, dump out their cigarettes dump out their illegal drugs and all that crap pharmaceuticals are going to disappear all this insane trash that people have been trying is all going to bow down before god food god's going to win everyone's going to worship god everyone's going to know the true god father son and holy ghost people are going to get baptized in water all across the world many people will get baptized in cocoa water to the glory of god okay who put his name on it and it represents the bitter cross of jesus christ um and um pfft. People are going to actually be happy. School systems are going to crumble for everyone's happiness. People are going to walk away from stupid textbooks and all sorts of dumb courses that put people in slavery. Um, it's essentially going to be the greatest landslide victory in the history of the universe. Um, praise God. I'm happy. And I'm sitting here having a breakfast, which equals cocoa fast. Done. Okay. So all of this is going to be achieved because of God food on the inside of people taken seriously and all the other crap that shouldn't come inside them taken seriously. Okay. So... Um, two no-nos, okay? I am 100% wheat-free, 100% dairy-free, okay? For ver for various reasons. But there, once in a while, I can stomach a little bit of dairy in certain forms, but I believe I'm basically on the track to be 100% hardline. Um, and, um, it, it jumped to the root of the matter as I did a long time ago, okay? The, the, the cow's milk is not made for humans. It's made for the cow's offspring. <laughs> okay? And so if you just jump to the root of the matter, you know, truly, you'll be set free from every single stupid product that comes forth from the dairy industry, including, you know, I mean, okay, you know, I'm sure there's a time and a place for, you can do it once in a while. Let me let me just leave it at that, okay? Of course you're free. You can, you can do it once in a while, but uh, I'm totally promoting a, a dramatic reduction in people's consumption of anything that comes from a cow's udder. <laughs> Just prune it back dramatically in your life and you'll be honest with me and yourself that you're actually way the happier and healthier for it. Period. Okay. Um, um, like I said, there's nothing wrong with a little bit here and there, but once you start pruning it back, you'll be like, Oh my gosh, I'm so glad that I've pruned this back. And we'll see how far you go. Eventually, you might prune it completely off of your life. Completely. Um, <clears throat> um, <laughs> thank God for God food. So, thank God the greatest parties on earth are here and are coming. I've been doing it with God for a long time. Now it's just a matter of more people coming into the party. Um... I just, I'm just so thankful. Um, lies, lies are just collapsing like, like houses of cards. Clutter stores are just collapsing. People aren't caring about real estate and dead junk anymore. They're, they're all getting in tune with what God is saying. Because you understand that the future is sharing. When everyone gets set free on God food and the Holy Spirit on the inside, there's just going to be so much ridiculous love and openness and love and sharing that people are going to wake up and realize, wait a second, now that we're all sharing all of our property and real estate with each other, no one needs, no one, no one even cares. Like, it's like, it's, it's, it's called freedom. It's called non-possession. It's like, all of a sudden, like, no one even cares about, like, 
competing with who thinks they own what. It's like, no, everyone owns everything and we all have friends and we all sh we jump into each other's houses as if it was all communal and everyone actually shares their stuff and everyone's all of a sudden rich and wealthy and friends and in love and everyone just shares everything because God has done this. I'm not even joking. That's what that's what's coming. People are actually going to have ridiculous friends. There's going to be ridiculous holy house parties where God food is the drink of choice. People are going to drink as much cocoa powder as much cocoa powder as much cocoa water as they can and want. Get as high as they want with no downers. Everyone's going to be singing their head off the praises of the Lord. They're going to be strumming guitars, doing finger work like you wouldn't believe because God food gives you incredible finger dexterity and incredible motor skills. Mus musicians are going to be high on God food. The parties are going to be real. The joy is going to be real. Everyone's going to be singing their head off, singing the praises of the Lord. They're going to invite more people into the house party. Everyone's going to be drinking God food. Everyone's going to get higher. Know that this stuff is the cat's meow. And this whole thing is going to spread like wildfire across the universe. People are going to get called out of depression, called out of bank buildings, called out of office buildings, called out of stupid boring jobs, called out of all sorts of depressing intellectual psychopathic jobs that left them feeling just like, you know, like, like, like a minus two professor all day. You've seen these people for a lifetime. You've seen bored teachers. You've seen dead, depressed professors. It's because they don't have any God food. Well, that's all going to change. They're all going to be set free from all this meaningless information that didn't bring them any happiness, didn't bring God any happiness, and people are actually going to get happy on planet Earth, okay? Um, and as a result of that, you're going to see incredible parties, incredible love, incredible laughter, people actually coming over to each other's houses like never before, parties like you wouldn't believe, pool parties, brown water cocoa pool parties, um, where people are actually doing cannonballs into cocoa water and drinking it as they laugh their heads off and sing the praises of God. That's the main thing. The love of God is going to go through the roof because this stuff is internationally called God food. Um, you're going to see people from every background of Christianity singing their heads off as they drink cocoa with water. Okay, every form, okay, of Christian background, okay, I don't care what name you put on it, everyone worships Christ who is God. They're going to be drinking their cocoa powder with water, singing the praises of God, okay, gathering together, just like, hey, yeah, you drink God food too, yeah, we all love the Holy Trinity, yeah, let's get high together. And it's happy and it's holy, okay, and there's no downer. Um, so, it, it's going to be actually awesome. Kids are going to be on this. There's going to be little kids drinking their cocoa. Be like, yeah. Um, and seniors are going to be like, yeah, I can walk again. Um, that's it. So you, you just have to dive in. You just have to enter in. And um, it's going to be, it's, quite frankly, it's going to be downright hilarious. It's going to be downright hilarious. Um, because in, qu in case you haven't noticed, uh, what you shove in here, on a daily basis, completely controls your feelings. But I mark my words, there's actually a food that God has chosen that is far more than just physical, chemical, scientific. It's actually a spiritual experience. Why? Because it has God's name on it. And because God is so passionate about the glory of his name, okay, when you deliberately, every single second of any single day, make a choice to consume pure natural cocoa powder with water, God, the supernatural one, God, the supernatural God, actually enters into your being and your life and actually starts blessing you with supernatural joy and supernatural feelings and all sorts of revelations and prophecies and, and hope and faith and, and feelings of love that you never thought you would experience from any physical substance that you shove in here. And so I promise you, this is just going to be an explosion of people feeling God worldwide as they drink pure natural cocoa powder with water all day, every day. They're going to be like, well, I want some God food. I want some God food. I want to experience God. And they'll be like, well, yeah, go go right ahead. Have as much as you want. The kids will be like, can I have some God food? Be like, yeah, you can have some God food. Be like, kids will be prophesying. They'll be dancing. They'll be like praising the Lord. It's going to be hilarious. It's going to be downright hilarious. So um, remember God food equals freedom, equals happy, equals blessed. You're going to see weddings where God food is the official drink of choice. You're going to see honeymoons where people are drinking God food day and night while making love. You're going to see marriages where the, the husband and wife drink God food all day long, produce like 20 babies in less than um, 20 years. And it's going to be absolutely hilarious. It's going to be so hilarious. People are going to be like breaking God food records. Um, the, the, the demand for cocoa worldwide is going to be an absolute explosion, like you've never seen an explosion for any sort of food, like you've never seen a food craze in the history of the universe, and it's just going to be, yep, God food, God food, God food. It's like the mouth of the Lord has spoken, God food, God food, God food, for everyone's happiness and freedom. And um, 
it, it's, it's just going to be downright hilarious. Like I said, there's going to be actually chocolate pools. You're probably going to see pastors, you know, elders, and like people in the church actually doing cannonballs into cocoa pools to the glory of God, saying, praise ye the Lord. And it's going to be just plain hilarious. Um, like I said, you, you're going to see people from every background drinking cocoa powder with water, Pentecostal, uh, Lutheran, Mennonite, they're all going to be drinking the God food, saying, praise God Almighty, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Thank you, Lord, for this gift, and thank you for joy on the inside. You're going to see that happen. It's going to bring people together. Uh, of every creed, background, nation, tribe, language, you're going to see Japanese people drinking cocoa powder with German people. You're going to see Asian people drinking with the Americans. You're going to see the Africans drinking with the New Zealanders and the Australians. They're going to be drinking their God food, praising God Almighty, the Holy Trinity, Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Say, thank you, Lord, for joy like never before on the inside. And they're going to have competitions. I mean, you just it's, 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 it's all going to be sacred. It's all going to be holy. Okay, You know that there's a, a proper amount to everything that we do Okay, in this life, consume, including food. But you can take this cocoa thing higher, as the Lord has been leading me to do Okay, for over a year now. Okay, And every day is sweeter than the last. That's the power of cocoa. Your roots get better and better every day that you continue on this stuff. So every day with Jesus is actually sweeter than the last. So higher and higher we all go, and everyone's just going to, I'm telling you, it's, it's what is going to be called the cocoa craze, but it's, but it's, it's not a fad, it's actually here to last. <laughs> it's like, you're going to be, you're going to see cocoa worldwide be heralded as like the cat's meow for people to shove in here with water day or night, and it's just, it's just going to like, um, so because God is crazy about love and joy and peace and all the fruits of the Spirit, and all of them are jacked through the clouds when people drink God food. Doesn't it make sense? Yes, it does. Okay, so, um, and by the way, this is a secret from the Lord that he's reserved. I mean, it's, it's, it's been blessing people. I've said enough, okay? Here, remember, the cocoa equals secret, okay? Look at the word secret. R-S equals cocoa. That's a revelation from the Lord. The rest of the letters in secret... Bell, um, build the T-H-E perfectly. You've got the T, the E, and then an E plus a C equals an H. So, secret equals the cocoa. Did you get that? God has a very precious secret that has now been revealed to you and the whole world. Secret equals the cocoa. Okay? And you can take the cocoa as high as you want for a lifetime. And you'll experience God like crazy. Okay? I promise you. You'll experience God. Cocoa is not just a um, physical, chemical, nutritional experience. Cocoa actually glorifies God, and therefore it invites God to, um, to bless you and actually do things inside you and with you that are amazing and extremely delightful, supernatural. Okay, So um, if you want to experience God today, drink some pure natural cocoa powder with water. And watch where he takes you. Turn yourself totally loose. Be yourself. Um, turn yourself totally free. Be completely free. Okay. After you drink as much cocoa powder with water as you want. And just marvel and, and watch at where God takes you as a result of drinking um, God food first. Okay. So um, pff, this is going to be hilarious. I promise you by the Lord. This is going to be hilarious in all the right ways as people dive in to this revelation and um, and take this thing higher. You're, you're going to see laughter and giddiness like you wouldn't believe. 